Hello, this is me, Court. Wait, hold up. I have to fix this. I can't. Okay, that's more better. All right. Hello, guys. It is me, Corey, here for another video of my Let's Play world. On my last Let's Play, I said that I was going to go to the nether and look for that nether fortress so that I can get a saddle for my horse. That's probably like the last thing I want in my world is a horse. If I ever encounter with a blaze and I could get a blaze rod, I could get a, a brewing stand so I can make potions and stuff. I basically have everything but a brewing stand. I also have an anvil. I crafted that all I needed was a lot of lucky for me. I already had that from the beginning. But before I actually do go into the nether, um, I'm more than aware that it's going to be hard for me to find the fortress. I got worried for a second because I thought that they only had the fortress on PC and on console edition. But my friend said that it's only on it's on um, pocket edition as well. But different worlds are hard to find the fortress, so it's going to be hard for me to search for the uh, fortress as well. I was wondering though, when Stampy did his uh, series quest to kill the Ender Dragon, when he went to the Nether, he was searching the Nether fortress. He, he made it seem so easy, like how? But yet, if I go into the Nether, it's going to be very hard for me to find the Nether fortress. It's going to be definitely hard. Alright, so now before I actually go into the nether, not only I'm going to check and see if I have everything. Hold on, I, I'm not really good at multitasking. But yes, in my last video I was talking about how you would need up to like 12 of, for you to create the nether portal. You don't necessarily need 16 because most people, they built the whole portal to, with obsidian. But I'm telling you, you don't need... 16 but throughout my let's plays I might not be able to show you in this let's play particularly but do, eventually I'll, you will see what I'm talking about most people that plays minecraft and that knows everything about minecraft definitely knows exactly what I'm talking about but yes uh let me see I got 12 okay I finally got 12 I got diamond pickaxe I want to get me a sword because I am going to turn on the difficulties I'm gonna need some food as well, not to mention. Uh, let's see here. Oh, before before I continue on doing what I'm doing, because I said that I'm not good at multitasking, there is a, a particular channel that I would like to thank because he gave me a shout out. So therefore, it's only right for me to return the exact same gratitude. The name of that channel is I hope I pronounced this channel right. Is B Bug Yog M C B. But it's right there. So if I did pronounce it wrong, he'll let me know if I did. But as you can see here, he has a lot of subscribers. I subscribe to him, as you can see. I think he subscribed to me too. But uh, um, yeah, um, hit that like, hit that subscribe. This, um, I'm sorry, I'm stuttering a little bit. It will be in the link down below. If you don't mind, please subscribe to this channel. Why? Uh, gosh, go down. Got to see if I'm recording. Yes, I am. All right. Oh, um, I got wood from. Oh, yeah, because I was crafting me a stick to make a diamond pickaxe. I'm going to carry rotten flesh with me. That's no. I read. Something's wrong about that for a second. Pretend that you never saw that. I'm looking for food. It has to be in, in someone's chest. Okay, I guess I'll take that. And uh, I'll cook a raw. No, that's raw. Mm -mm. Don't want to eat raw fish now. All right, but I will cut into the video so I can get my food. I think I have a lot. But I will cut into the video. Nothing major, but I w I just like to cut into the video. Notice a lot throughout my whole Let's Play series that I cut a lot into the video. But yes, I will cut into the video. Hello, chicken. I do not have any seeds for you. So I'm sorry, chicken. I should really kill you, but I don't want to kill you, chicken. All right. You know, if only I can name you. Where? I need a name tag. I'm going to name you. Stay right there, chicken. Do not go anywhere. Okay? Okay. All right, I am back, and yes, yes, I did have a long conversation with that chicken here. But yes, I, I do have to apologize. Sorry that I did cut into the video 
my mom didn't need me for something and I didn't want it to disturb the let's play series that I have been making but let's hit um but yes let's hit that button wait what oh yeah yeah, yeah. that's right all right all right so once we climb up these vines we are good to go so let us click that button and let us go right into the nether but yes the reason I might I might cut into the video because every once in a while because uh as you already know it takes a long time to find the no the fortress of course I won't spend all of the episodes looking for the fortress but episode by episode we will continue looking for the fortress if I cannot find anything if I cannot find a fortress at all well then I don't know what to say at that part but I know what to do now let's hit that button Oh, hold on. I forgot one more thing. I do need a flint and steel. Because I cannot activate the nether uh, portal without the thing. Alright. Oh, yeah. Before I go in, for those who don't, for, for those who are new to this episode, and are new, and, and, that, that, and that they don't know what's going on around here, let me explain something to you. Let me just summarize. I have a city in here. I'm planning to go to the nether fortress. Once I finish going, once I find another fortress, once I get a saddle, because they have a chest inside of another fortress, I'll put, I'll set up another portal, and therefore I will go right back into the world. But here's the question, when I set up another fortress, will I respawn here, or I'll, I'll respawn somewhere else in the world? That's something I should be focusing on. You know, it would be pretty smart if I did have, if I did like leave trails of cobblestone. So, uh, yeah. Um, matter of fact, mm, I don't know. Let me check in here. Oh, yeah. Nothing's in there. No, we did have some good times in Season 2, Episode 14 and 15. Too bad only, like, two players showed up. But it was all worth it. Let's go. Let us go to the nether. Sorry. I will never do that again. Whoa. A lot of fire here. I did not turn on the difficulties as of right now because I don't want to get hit by no. Yeah, you understand my circumstances.
Well, well, as you can see here, I am pretty doomed. I'm in the corner next to a lava that could possibly leak over here. I don't have an armor that's fire protection. All I have is, and there's a zombie pigman. Don't come over here, please. Don't let me kill you, please. I don't want to. This is, this is really bad. Just, yeah, please go, 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 please. But, sadly, the fun will have to end here. You call this fun? This is not fun. But please, hit that like button if you enjoyed today's episode. And look out for episode 5. Where, unfortunately, we have to continue looking for the nether fortress. And I will see you all later. No, 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 no! No!